on the Finfish YouTube channel. This is a massive tackle overhaul. I got all this stuff and I just want to show it to you. So yeah, let's get into it. So yeah, this is what I got. I got a huge range of lures and plastics. I'm going to be showing you all of them. Right, we're going to do the plastics to start off. But yeah, first off, we have these saltwater assassin goldfish plastics. These look good for skippy snapper and stuff like that. I have these jig heads. Uh, they look like they would fit around this size. But I'm not sure. I think it'd be alright. So. Yeah, so that's the first item on the list. Let's go to the next one. Alright, let's do these. These are... What are these? So these are... Like these eyeball tail things. Cool little plastics. Look like sandworms. I don't really like Belkley Gulp sandworms, but these ones have a cool little ball on the end. This looks good for brim. Got two packets of them. This one's a bit darker. This one's got the shine and it's small bright. But yeah, that's that. Um, okay, next. Power bait. Power bait. It's pretty classic. You know, I've got this weird shape that I thought looked a bit unique. It's like, kind of like a crayfish, little crayfish thing. So yeah, that's that. I've got these gambler plastics. They're green and I've got a cool, a cool glistening thing on them that makes them look shiny. These Berkeley Gulp crab things, they look alright, I don't know. But I hope I can get a big flathead or something on them. Snapbacks. Two packets of snapbacks. I've got this green kind of colour. And then this, I don't know what this is, but like, it's like kind of blue and whitish. These look really good for snapper, I think that's the four. And last but not least for the plastics, Mad Eye Paddle Prawns. This is yellow colour. Um, definitely one of my favourite lures. They just work so well and they're scented as well. These are the 7 inch ones. I have some jig heads in my tackle box which I can show you in a later video when I actually get to using these. But yeah, let's go on to the lures. I have a few lures with me. I'm going to leave this one to last because it's pretty cool. Yeah, first we have this Salmo Butcher. It's a floating lure and I'm not sure what it's for. It looks like it catch, you know, redfin perch and stuff. So look at that. It's pretty nice. So yeah, that's that. Uh, it looks alright probably hook up on a bream with it, but I think it's more for freshwater fishing. Skip that back on. Okay. Scum dog. These are really good. I really like them. Really good for whiting and other fish. I reckon you might even get small tailor on these, possibly, if you're lucky enough, but yeah. That's what these are for. They're mainly for whiting. It's a bit of a big size, but I don't know if you can see it, but that they're good. So next one. Oop, look like a crankbait. So just a classic hard body. Uh brim and everything. Flat head. You get lots of stuff in that. Oh, pretty good lure. These are RMGs, uh, brim, whatever will take these. Let's see, it says all types, all tri 
types, bass, brim, flathead, perch, and redfin. These look really good. I have used them down south uh, in Walpole, and I've caught brim on them. So they're pretty nice. And last but not least, we have probably my favorite thing in the whole entire set. This is the Dive Pirates jig. This is just really awesome and I'm so excited that I actually got one of these because it's probably very expensive on the markets to this day. It's got this really nice kind of squid thing there, like a teaser, and the hooks are in it. And this will have a really nice fluttering motion. I reckon you get your snapper, your dewfish on this, everything in the deep sea would take this I reckon. It's a really nice little one, I can't wait to try it out. And a good, a cool thing about this lure is that you can actually tie it on from different places. So you can tie it on from the front, you can tie it on from the middle. And you might even be able to tie it on from the back. Front, top, middle, yeah I think you can. Uh, so that's pretty cool. So yeah, that's that. It's got these really nice, like, kind of, uh, power, or, like, abalone looking eyes on it. Look, and it's just a really nice lure. Can't wait to try it out. So I'm going to get out my favourites now, and, uh, and I'll go over them, and yeah, then, uh, yeah. So, my favourite thing for the hard body lures, or just lures, is, of course, the pirate's jig. Just sick. And my favourite plastic, mad eye paddle prawns. Just amazing. Snapper destroyers, jewfish destroyers, everything destroyers. I actually have some of these, but in a different colour, which is probably the ones that I'll be using. Other than these yellow ones, because they do have a bit of white on the bottom, but you know, I just prefer the orange colour, looks a bit more natural, so yeah, that's that. And if I'm going for a brim, they look good. And if I was going to try and catch my more plastic, I'd probably use some of them, they look really nice. But I don't think any of these beat my Z Man's. Uh, for the brim, Z-Man lures, Z-Man plastics are just really nice. So yeah, that's the, probably the first video on the Finfish YouTube channel. Uh, I'll be uploading more videos soon. Hopefully, get to go to Rottnest and I can show you some things that we do there. So yeah, see ya.